Okay, so we're selling our Isuzu Fargo. It's a 1994. I've lived in it full time for five years and two months. So excuse the mess because I'm still cleaning it. But everyone's asking me for photos. Uh, this actually doesn't belong in here. Um, and that stuff I'm going to be taking out. So the first owner had it for eight years and he wrote his stuff in which I've got in here then the next person had it um, for three months and then he realized that he couldn't uh, use it because he had emphysema and struggled to get into the bed so after he spent a lot of money on it he um, traded it in for a caravan and I walked in as he was trading it and I bought it so for five and five years and two months I've been documenting all the work I've done on it so yeah the shocks that came about the alternator everything oh I looked at putting a shower in the back um, I never did but there's some information there but yeah so I've documented everything as well as the previous two owners so I'm the third owner I'll just show you around automatic it's got awesome wheels uh, I was thinking about putting a caliphant here because that's your fresh water and your grey water is underneath there uh, this is the vent for your fridge and I know it's dirty I'm still cleaning it uh, this is your power plug cool wheels you've got um, a house battery and a truck battery so the house battery I replaced maybe three Christmases ago and the truck battery I have never replaced actually um, and you've got it covered here so that originally the toilet was over there so that bit there is where the paper, toilet paper holder was but I have moved the toilet into this white box which is still full of stuff. Um, so yeah, as I say, excuse the mess. Um, you've got storage underneath here, and you've got storage underneath here. This is the kitchen. You've got a three-way fridge. So you've got gas, battery, and power. And here is your gas bottle, which is 4.8, uh, sorry, 4.5. You've got your running water, Oh, I might have to turn the switch on. Like that. You got your element. You got more storage up here. Got more storage in here, which is like that, full of stuff still. Now, um, originally, this chair used to face this way. This white box has um, been replaced with um, I had a couch here that faced this way that way or you could lay it down to make a double bed down here and then you've got a king size mattress up here okay so the couch is going to come with this camper so I'm just going to put the couch in here and whoever decides to buy it can choose what they decide to do when um, the couch is here and the t this chair is facing this way, you've got a table that will come with the sale as well, and so that lays down. Now I'm just going to put the camera over here, and hopefully you can see me. Turn it down like that. Okay, so close the bed up. You just take one pole. And use the mattresses like that. Right there. And then it just clips in like so. You take the pole down so when you're driving it's not clunking around. So now you've got such a bigger space. You've got lights either side of here. Um, yes, it comes with curtains, I've just taken them down. And yeah, if you've got any questions, 
Please let me know.